America celebrates the 4th of July with fireworks. And you want to make sure, though, you leave it up to the pros on Oahu since consumer fireworks are illegal. You need a permit to pop the red firecrackers and only from 1 to 9 at night tomorrow. Now, each county has its own rules when it comes to fireworks, but aerials, all those aerials you see there, those are illegal across the state unless if you have a pyrotechnics permit. And joining us live this afternoon is Honolulu Fire Inspector Carl Otsuka. Thanks so much for being with us this afternoon. Absolutely. Glad to be here. And, you know, the bottom line is really keeping everyone safe. So the fireworks ban on Oahu started back in 2011, and yet it seems that sometimes it's like, what ban? Because we see so many fireworks. But the bottom line really is safety. So you're a fire inspector. Have you personally gone to inspect fires where there was damage or injuries caused by fireworks? Actually, um, as a firefighter, um, yeah, we've had uh, uh, many house fires. Uh, the major, the most major uh, thing that we have, we respond to during New Year's Eve or uh, 4th of July involving fireworks. A lot of it is medical. Um, the smoke, the excess smoke, uh, people with uh, breathing difficulty just, of them are calling 911 to get to a hospital. You know, some of them have asthma. Now, what is the penalty if people are caught with illegal fireworks? Um, I'm not too sure of the penalty, uh, but if you do see illegal firework uh, and want to report it, uh, you can call 911 and uh, HPD will be on scene to, uh, to take information and see if uh, an arrest can be made. Okay. And again, you know, on Oahu, you're not allowed to use those consumer fireworks, but you can pop those red firecrackers with a permit. Uh, how many people have gotten those permits so far? How many permits have been sold? So this year, uh, 22 permits were sold for the 4th of July, so it should be a pretty mild 4th of July, right? Should be. Uh, if, yes. Uh, and just keep in mind that, uh, you know, the aerials are illegal and uh, you could be arrested and, you know, taken to the police station if you're caught lighting those, those aerial rockets. Uh, also, if... Uh, the other things that aren't allowed are even sparklers or, you know, those uh, fountains. Uh, so please don't get caught uh, setting any of those off. Firecrackers is the only thing allowed with permits. Okay, great. Great message there. Hopefully people listen, right? Hopefully. Yeah. If you guys do want to see fireworks, um, this year we're having... Um, Loa Beach, Haleiwa, uh, Polynesian Culture Center. Uh, those are the three that, uh, that's going to be holding uh, public displays. Also, just to let you know, this isn't like New Year's Eve. Um, as far as the firecrackers are concerned, the legal time to pop firecrackers, the red firecrackers, are from 1 p.m. to 9 p.m. So try not to go beyond 9 p.m. on uh, 4th of July night. And again, that's only for those with the, the 22 permits that were sold, right? For those firecrackers. Yes. Okay, yes. thank you so much with that important message. Honolulu Fire Inspector Carl Otsuka, thanks so much for joining us.